What's up, everybody? It's Aaron here, and welcome back to some more That's Not My Neighbor. Today, what we're working on is the rest of some of these achievements here. I know we still need uh, 100 doppels captured. So, we need 14 more doppelgangers to, to get this one. We might not get it in this episode. Probably the next one. And then these ones are going to just take forever because I need, what, uh, 34 more playthroughs on to survive. Uh, for this achievement and then all together i'm gonna need what 85 more cheap uh, 85 more playthroughs total so that'll work out on its own time um and then this one we can't get until we get all these but we're definitely going to be working on this one so let's go ahead jump in and see how it goes ain't nobody got time for no introductions oh fuck me sideways all righty well mr cipriani hmm. um were you playing in the dirt today? See, and this one doesn't say he's a businessman. This one doesn't say what the job is. So I'm wondering if it doesn't say what their job is, if they're just doppelgangers altogether. Um, 1968. Um, you're not even right anyways, though, so I'm not even going to let you through, and you're not even on the list. But I do want to find out what you got to say about your appearance. My appearance? Well, yes, your appearance. Worms? Uh, yeah. They're not worms. They're grains. I mean, grain? Uh, yeah, you gotta go. It kind of makes my stomach hurt. <laughs> three, three, one, two, D, D, D. For your, all your Angus worm face needs. Let's go. Yeah, dude. Angus, he's here, but he's got worms coming out of his face. I know, he said they're grain. What a dumbass. They're not grains. All right, thanks. I appreciate it. Uh, I was like, damn, did the game bug out? Cleaning protocol completed. You can continue your job. Next time, could you guys open the steel curtain so that I could actually, like, see what's going on in there? You are on the list, right? Roman Stalinsky. 68. DDD, residence building on the first floor. Da, da, da. Okay, but the problem is, is what do you do for a living? You're an accountant. And this doesn't say my job is an accountant. He's got the scar on the chin, the nose, the angry eyes. I guess we just risk it for the biscuit, right? Or do we call? 1152. I haven't let him in yet, so he's not going to be there anyway. So this is kind of just a waste of time, I'm pretty sure. Hello, Lois Delinsky speaking. My husband is not at home. Well, we're going to let him in. And then the real one's going to come back and be like, I'm an accountant. Um, green eyes. Yeah, I mean, you look right. You look, you just look right. Just go through, just go through. So we got Robertsky, Selene, Arnold, Reptilian, oh, of course, and then Gloria. On which floor? Third. Ooh, uh, yeah, long face, but no short hair. Where's a hairband? She is a housewife. So she wouldn't be coming from her job. But I'm thinking she would be saying something along the lines of like, oh, I came from, you know, the grocery or I came from visiting my mother or something along those lines, right? Like, I came from getting my hair cut or shopping. Some, something. Uh, I don't know. But you look correct. Same double chin. Yeah. 
Yeah. Well, if this hair, and it could just be happenstance, but this hair looks longer than this hair, doesn't it? Like by a long shot. Probably just starting to overthink everything now. See, her hair's not down to her mid shoulder. It goes right here. But <clears throat> we're gonna say it's okay. We're gonna we're gonna say it's okay. Should I call? I should call. I should call. Four two five eight. Even though I haven't let you through yet, we should call. Hi, Alf speaking. No, she's not back home. Yeah, didn't think so. Is she back? No. Alright, I want to see if I can call somebody random. Or two. I want to see what happens. Like, if I call... I think that's the Rude Boys, right? Yeah, Stephen Rude Boy. Okay. So you can just call random apartments. <laughs> you can just call random people. All right, so if we get Steven or um, McCooley, then we know they're not, they're all automatically because we already called. So that's good. All right, you can go in. You can go in this time. Sad that right there. Excellent. Please open the door. Ugh. I hate that. And then it didn't make a noise after they walked through. Usually they're going. Hoo -hoo 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 -hoo. Just Celine, you got to write everything. And we already know you're not at home and you're on a list. Is the mole on the right side of your face, though? Where are you at? 104. Yeah, the mole's on the right side of your face. I should say the left side of your face, but. Well, the right cheek, yeah. The right right side of your face so and we know you're not at home already dee -dee 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 -dee. but this doesn't say I'm coming home from my job as a model I'm, I'm losing this one for sure this one's difficult dude the last episode it was good they were all like obvious obviously fucked up excellent excellent no maybe not excellent what am I missing here let me know in the comments where I messed up. <laughs> Cause I know I did. I know I did. <laughs> I wonder if one day we're gonna get a doppel that's actually just a doppel, like we so we can see exactly what it looks like. Your eyes are fucked up, Miss Afton. First off, you're not even on the list, but your eyes are fucked up. Come from my job as a teacher. You see how small your eyes are normally? Mia. That's what you call yourself. You look like a fish or something, right? You're all wall-eyed. <laughs> yeah, you're wrong altogether, dude. Dial three three one two D D D for all your wrong-eyed Mia needs. You've contacted the D D D. Well, yes, we've got Mia here. Um, yeah, her eyes are all fucked up. We send somebody? All right, cool. Thank you. <coughs> completed, completed, completed. And continue your job. Well, thank you for the permission, sir. Much appreciation. Zipper face. Holy shit, look at you. You look like a Cenobite or something, right? Like if you were to unzip that and then peel back the skin, you would look like, like a Cenobite, something from Hellraiser. Um, yeah, we're not even gonna let you through, but I do want to see what you got to say about your appearance. Mm, my face? Yeah. Zipper? Yeah, the zipper. What the fuck's wrong with it? I had a nose job or whatever. Oh, all right. <laughs> you might want to find another plastic surgeon. It fucked you up, kid. Uh, three, three, one, two, D, D, D. I can't even do it. Oh, it's so funny, dude. Yeah, the kid came back from school with a zipper attached to her face. I know she claims to be the real her, but it's we know it's not. Send somebody? All right, cool. Thank you. All right, thank you, sir. 
Thank you. What it look like when you unzipped her face? <laughs> oh my God. You're on the list for sure, Arnold Schmidt. You don't have anything weird going on except for your ID is missing. You came from your job as a writer. You're on 201. Big eyebrows. You look exactly correct. I just need your ID. Got the DDD logo here. What's your ID? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to show me my ID. 71, DDD. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Same nose, same eyes. You're good, dude. We'll let you in this time, Arnold. Uh, I think we already let you through. And you don't have a big eyebrow. You have separate eyebrows. See, this is where you fucked up, sir. You're supposed to only have one long, hey, Arnold ass eyebrow. And you have a split in your eyebrow. So, yeah, we're not even going to try this. My hat? No, not your hat, your eyebrow. It's a hat. I mean, okay. And where's your entry request? Is it necessary, the entry request? Yes, it is. We are neighbors. You know me. Oh, I fucking finally met the neighbor. Anyways. <laughs> I don't need one. Listen, listen, sir. Listen, I want to hear what you had to say about that. You already answered my question. Well, fuck you. All right. So, yeah. You, uh, you're done fucked up, sir. You, 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 you're done. You're done. Yeah, Arnold, uh, uh, Roman showed up and he's not correct. And he's angry and he's claiming to be my neighbor. And I'm sorry to say it, but that's not my neighbor. <laughs> All right, thank you. Cleaning protocol completed. Oh no. Didn't we already let you through? It's gonna be me and my husband are already at home. There's gotta be something wrong here. Is it the hair? No. Fuck, I think I let the wrong one through. Come for my job as a banker. Damn it. I knew I messed up. But I couldn't see what was wrong with the other one. Probably, she probably didn't have the mole or something. Something petty like that that I missed. Because I'm a thousand percent sure I just messed up. Five, one, two, three. This is a house I actually don't call that much. Hello, Arnold Schmidt speaking. My wife's not, I, I could have swore I let you through already. Is she back? Yeah, she's back. I thought I let you through already. Am I thinking of something else? Okay, so we let her through, him through, her through, her through, her through. So we're just waiting for Robertsky Peachman now. I mean, you look correct. Everything about you looks right. So I guess we let you in. So everything is in order? It should be. Maybe I can. I don't know. Now you're making me question everything. Just go. Just go. This is a difficult episode here. This is definitely a difficult one. Um, I mean, okay, you do got the little tiny eyes. Looking like Beaker from the Muppet Babies. Uh, 1973, DDD, 9730. Shoemaker, 102. There we go, 102. 7.30, Shoemaker, long neck. Without eyebrows. Big nose, has a goatee. I mean, you look correct. There's, I don't see anything wrong. I don't see one thing wrong. 
Now that you say that, though. You know, you got the same silly color and everything. A shoemaker, you look like you should be on a safari or something, not a shoemaker. All right, Peachman. All right, Peachman. We're gonna let you in this time. Mr. Afton. You're not on the list, dude. You're not on the list. I see you put your glasses back on. Is that because you just didn't like your eyes? Oh, you regrew your nose too. <laughs> You regrew your nose, but you're not on the list, dude. I just I can't do it. You gotta go. You gotta go. Yeah, Afton's back and he's not on the list. Yeah, no, he hasn't turned into purple guy yet, but we're gonna find out soon. Yeah, I'm waiting for it to happen too. All right, cleaning protocol completed. Well, thank you, sir. Next. Oh my gosh. I think we already let you through, didn't we? The first one we let through. And he was wearing a hat. I'm gonna call you your floor. I'm gonna call you 1152. Because I'm not sure if you're right. And then we'll look at your paperwork. Hi, Roman speaking. Hello, Roman speaking. My wife and I are in the apartment right now. All right, Roman. I'm not expecting any visitors. All right, so should I send them up then? All right. Oh, <laughs> I'm resident of the building. I live on first floor, apartment one. Okay, where's your ID at, sir? Now I just need to know. Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. I forgot to show my ID. That's funny, dude. I mean, they get pretty good. But this, this always gives it away. This handwritten, really poorly worded, misspelled apartment. Apartment. <laughs> All right, Roman. You got to go, Papa. Ah, <laughs> uh, three, three, one, two, D, D, D for all your incorrect Stalinsky needs. Let's go. Yeah, it's a fake Roman. Everything was written wrong. All right, thank you. You can continue your job. All right, how bad did we do? Because I know that's got to be one of the last ones, right? Oh, shit. <laughs> that's got to be my favorite Cipriani yet. <laughs> Mr. Cipriani, I'm sorry, but you're too under the influence, bro. <laughs> we cannot let you in the building. <laughs> I don't know what you're on, but whatever it is, it's got to be good. Oh, fucking A. Look at that smile and everything, dude. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> What's strange about my eyes? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> They're normal human eyes like any other. <laughs> All right, dude. All right. Oh, fucking A, dude. <laughs> three, three, one, two, D, D, D. Bro, your crazy eyed Cipriani needs. <laughs> All right, yeah, Cipriani's back. No, he shrunk his neck. He's just got some fucking wacky ass eyes now. Yeah. All right, thank you. <laughs> yeah, did you see that, dude? All right, thanks, bud. <laughs> Uh, that was that was too good, man. Too good. All right. No doppels. Holy shit. Yo. Another rank S for the books. 
chalked up another rank S, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so now where are we at here? 93, we need seven more, seven more. So yeah, the next episode will definitely have that achievement. I wonder if we're gonna get like a, a new button for the wall or something. And if there, maybe, maybe after you capture 100, the doppels get more aggravated. You know what I mean? Like they get more aggro, so like, I don't know, maybe they become more hostile. That'd be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. Quarantine, survive 40 playthroughs. Fuck, but we've only survived seven, dude. We're getting there, slowly but surely. There are only 33 more times. Um, that was good, though. That was really, 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 really good. But this is where we're going to go ahead and end this one. I had, I had so much fun with that. That was, that was so, so fun. Um, that last Cipriani, though. Cipriani always gets me, dude. <laughs> Cipriani's the best when it comes to the doppels. But yeah, this is where we're going to go ahead and end this one. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys thought about the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, you guys have yourselves a great day.